guys, it's Shannon and Paul, and we're back with more LOL Surprise Furniture yes, today. Yes, we are. So we want to thank MGA for sending these to us so we could share with you guys. We are super excited to open these furniture packs. If you have not seen our other video, we opened the other two furniture packs, which were super duper awesome. Please go check out that video. Yep. But today we are opening the other two. So I'm going to be opening this one right here. This is going to be the bedroom set. I thought you were opening Diva. The beauty salon. I am? Were you? No. Nope. I'm going to open okay. this one. Okay. All I right. don't know what we're opening. All right. No problem. I'm opening both and Paul's opening nothing. <laughs> That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> I could open all these because these are like seriously one of the here. coolest things yeah. that I've ever seen. Yeah. I will sit here and watch you open them. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely love these furniture packs. I'm so excited that MGA did them and I love this packaging. I could just look at that holographic beautifulness all day long. It's pretty cool. Yep. So each box comes with 10 plus surprises. You get an exclusive doll. So like this is going to be Neonlicious, but she's in different clothes than, or it'd be Neon Cutie. Yeah. Neonlicious is the, the big doll. Yes. Neon Cutie. But she's in a different outfit than in previous things. So she just exclusive to this pack. Yes. Paul, would you like to show the one you're going to be sharing? Happy Beauty Salon <laughs> <laughs> with uh, Diva. Uh, so this is Series 1 Diva. Here is the accessories or the furniture we're going to get with our beauty salon and our little Diva doll and then of course a play set. So this is going to be a lot of fun too. Shannon, are you opening first or not? You go I? ahead. Okay. All right, here we go. And like Paul said, these boxes turn into play sets, yes. which is super cool. So you want to be careful opening your box. The lid can just be taken off and set aside. And then check this out. It's like some kind of crazy origami. Yeah. How it's worked. It's like, it's like a transformer. You lost a blind bag. Yeah. One fell out. Wait. <laughs> um, let me see. You have all kinds of stuff. Yeah. I've really kind of made a mess of this. Origami is not really my thing. Okay, here. Okay, there we go. Just, you have a blind bag back there. Okay, so I got them all. here's your play set. The way this goes together is super simple. Right here on each side, there's a little slit in the cardboard, and then you just take this corner and slide it right in, like so. And you do the same thing on the other side. That piece didn't need to be there, by the way. That was just part of the lid. There you go. So there is your beauty salon playset. Now, after you have this open for a little bit, this cardboard will kind of settle down and sit flatter. Cool. But there you go. There's your beauty salon. All right, I'm going to start off. We have a lot of blind bags here. This, our furniture is just in clear plastic bags. So we have a little chair. <laughs> That's a cute chair. To sit in. I like that. Oh, does that? The drawer actually pops out. Look at that. <laughs> That's Isn't awesome. that cool? I did not expect that. But the drawer actually does slide out. So we'll set our chair right there. Whoop, goes back. <laughs> right onto the rug. Look, that was perfect. Oh, yeah. Okay, next we have an attachment for our chair. Let me show you this. So this is really cool. Um, oh, you know what? This so does? That's not going to go on the chair. That's going to go on Are you sure? your... Well, maybe that's... Maybe you can just mix and match them because that's going to be your wash bowl, and then this is going to be the little thing that blow dries your hair or sets your hair. Oh, is that what it so is? So you can probably mix and match on the chair. Yeah, I bet it is. So this is actually really fun. So this is just like a normal beauty salon or barber shop. You'd sit in the chair, put your head back in there, and then they would take the little uh, sprayer. That's the best part of getting Spray your hair it. done. And I like that it has the little attachment right there to put the sprayer. And then, yeah, like Shannon said, you can kind of mix and match. Here, you can put the brain sucker. No. <laughs> yeah. So you sit this, in the chair. And then and then folds boom, down. And the government sucks your brain out. <laughs> That's not how that happens. And it goes down through there and out through the electrical Is socket. Is that how guys play with beauty salon toys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the CIA beauty salon. <laughs> That's to blow dry your hair or to set it. Like if you're getting a perm. Sucks your brain out. <laughs> Stop. That's why the government made the internet. Because <laughs> before they didn't have a way to get your brain. Stop, Paul. <laughs> I'm teasing. Okay, we, what is, oh, this is like a, uh, uh, what's that called, a crimper? Iron? Uh, 
Or a flat iron. A flat iron? Okay. Or a hair crimper. It could be either. Okay. So a gold same. crimper. Um, we have... This is awesome. It's a can of hairspray. Cool. I used to love oh, the Oh, on there. Yep, I used to love the 80s when everybody had this. One whole can of hairspray per... Yeah. <laughs> per view. Yeah. Per outing. <laughs> yeah. One can was one application. <laughs> <laughs> it was a single serve. All right, and then we have a little sponge or a little brush. That's a brush, not, not a sponge. That would be weird. So there's a little heart-shaped brush. Last but not least, piece of furniture. This is pretty cool. We have a little table for our LO girls to work at or sit at. And I bet, I bet these drawers come out too. I can't, <laughs> can't grab see. them. There you go. That you one do. does. That one does that too. That one does too. Cool. So I like these little hooks here because you could actually put your, your, um, your tools. tools. And your little mirror has a protective sheet over it. So yeah, it doesn't so it doesn't get, get scratched. scratched. You but can just you pull that off. Peel that off. It's going to be a real mirror. So that's very cool. Hairspray. We'll put that right there. Ready. And now let's start opening up blind bags. We have our bow. Little hair bow for Neva. We have... Our bottle, cute little pink bottle with a white top. I like how simple that is, but how bright. Here we have our outfit, which is her little silver uh, unitard thing with the big wide pink belt. That's awesome. We have Whoa. little shoes, little pink boots. Those are cute. Very cute. And. Last but not least, Diva! <laughs> All right, here is a little Diva. And look how cute she is. She's awesome. She is. I like her white hair. That is really cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's see. Does she color change? Now, the original Diva, I believe, color changed her hair. Well, not all of them, but some of not them could of. color change. This one does not. So actually, that's pretty cool because her hair actually is snow white, whereas the other ones almost had a like cream, a, like, like a yeah. yellowish cast to them. So I really like that her hair is white. Does she tinkle? She does not. Let's see. Does she spit or does she cry? She's like, yo, they call me Diva because I work in the beauty salon and I love all things fashionable in beauty. But sometimes she's bubbling. she's bubbling. Yeah, you see me bubbling. <laughs> That's because I eat a really big lunch every day because there's an all-you-can-eat Chinese buffet right next to the hair salon. So I go over there and I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. And Chinese food is really good because like you get really full really fast, but then you're like, oh, wow, egg rolls. I think I'll have four of those. <laughs> she's spinning yeah. again. And then I come back in and I'm like, oh, girl, your hair is so awesome. It's so good looking. I could just crimp it. I could style it and everything. She's like, oh, no, my tummy. Oh, bleh. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah. She spit all over the salon floor. She did. Okay, I'm gonna dry that up. Okay. You could get her dressed in and stick her in her salon if I you want. I'm going to. Now what's really cool about these is you can keep that cardboard playset and play with her in there. You can also put the furniture in your LOL dollhouse if you have. Or you can take even like a bookshelf or something and put these pieces in it and make your own whole custom little playset thing, which I might do. Because I think it would be super fun. All right, time to open the bedroom set. Get that loud plastic paper off. Here we go. So it just kind of all unfolds. Oh, look, we have a pink rug. And we're going to go ahead and open it this way and check out all our stuff. We have lots of blind bags here. I'm going to move to the side. Here's instructions for Paul. He never reads the instructions. Nope, never do. Okay, let's set up our play set. So again, super simple. You just put that piece in right there. Slide that piece in right there. And look at this. 
We have a cute bedroom set. Go ahead and we'll move the beauty salon over a little bit. I like the big screen TV over there with the three. That's like Queen Bee and her friends on TV. They're all wearing the same outfit. They're cute. Okay, so there's a bedroom. Oh, and let me show you over on this side. We have like a big bookshelf with all kinds of toys and books and radios and stuff. Okay, let's see. Is this going to be our bed? <laughs> okay, Diva looks super cute. Wait, I have to zoom in. You have to see. We'll just, we'll just zoom in. Look at Diva sitting there getting her hair done. The little hair thing fits right over her head. That is so cute. And then there's the rest of the furniture. Yep. That's awesome. And her little brain sucked out. Oh, she's not getting her brain sucked out. Now you know how Paul plays with toys. <laughs> okay, check out our bed. Look Ooh. at how cute this is. That's awesome. So it has this heart shaped. I'm going to guess that that's. Well, maybe that's the footboard. I was going to say that would be the headboard. I think it is. I think the heart is the headboard and then this is the footboard, but you could kind of do it however you want. But I like that big bed and it looks like we also get a bedspread. And a pillow. Two pillows. So we have two little aqua blue heart-shaped pillows. Little satiny pillows. Cute. And we have a little bedspread. This looks very like 90s. Yes. With this print. So we're going to put that on the bed. You guys can't even see that. We're putting it on the bed. And then we're going to put our little pillows up here on the bed too. We're going to put our little bed up here in the bedroom. Let's see. We're going to set it right over on that side. And check this out. It looks like we have a bed for one of the little sisters too, right? Oh, cute. Is that what this is? Uh, Yeah. Sure could be. I'm thinking that's what it's for. Or you could put a tiger or a yeah. cheetah. <laughs> a little kitty cat in there. A little kitty. Okay, yeah, I'm thinking that's a little bed for one of the little sisters. Yeah. Or you can put lots of stuffed animals and junk in there. Because everybody needs places in their bedroom to collect junk. That's right. You need a junk corral. That's what that is, a junk corral. Okay, you get this cute little bunny bear. A bunny bear. I'm calling it a bunny bear because this side looks like a bear and this side looks like a bunny. Yeah, it's a bunny bear. It's a bunny bear. It's a little stuffed animal. It's super adorable. Bunny bear. It's going to sit on the edge of the bed. Okay, and then we have lots of blind bags for our doll here. So let's see. We have some cute little yellow and black um, like little hiking boots. Yes. Here's our bottle. So, so far this looks the same as like normal it does. Neon Cutie. And with the exception of the color changing, that, that I believe is the same diva. Well, I thought her outfit was white instead of the gray. Nope. No, it was gray? It was gray. Hmm. Okay, here are our glasses. Super cute. And our cute little outfit. Yep. No, I believe that that is Neon Cutie's outfit. Hey! Doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> <laughs> Doo -doo. There she is! There's Neon Cutie! I love her tights. I do too. Her little pink and aqua striped tights. So there is Neon Cutie. Those would be I'm, really tough to find. Yeah. I'm having a hard time seeing how she's different, but... Yeah, I don't know that she same. is. I think she's the same. Okay, slide the water over the and it's water. time to check to see what she does. Let's yep. see if she color changes. That would be cool. She does not color change. Okay, Paul, you are up. Tinkle test. Nope, no tinkle. Uh, I think we might have another spitter on our hands. She's like, you, they call me Neon Cootie because I love everything that's bright and wild looking. It's like my bedroom is so bright and crazy looking. And all my clothes are very bright and everything. She's like, but sometimes when I'm not feeling good, I go in my room like, whoa, that's too bright. <laughs> oh my god, oh no, my stomach's feeling queasy, and the room just starts spinning. <laughs> I'm like, oh, gotta go to the bathroom. 
Ugh. I hope she made it. Yeah. It's like I made it that time. Sometimes it don't. So there's Neon Cutie enjoying her bedroom. Let's let's just take a look at these. These are so awesome. Look at all the little details. I love her bedroom. Yeah, it's so cute. Look at her little uh, line of Polaroid pictures hanging. I love the little video game system. She has a little cactus plant on her bookshelf. <laughs> and then over there, she's got a little camera collection on the top of that bookshelf. It, it, just the details. And she's already collecting junk. Yep. In her crib. <laughs> All right. So uh, there she is with her bunny bear on the bed. Here is Diva. Let's take a look at the backdrop here. Very cool. Lots of details. Oh, I like, oh, I like the little hair extension section. <laughs> That's a lot of fun. There it is. These are just so adorable. They are. All right, there's no way that we could possibly pick a favorite. We've only got two. So, uh, and so they're all not, my favorite. They are. So we're not going to do that, but uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to ask you guys, pick a favorite. Tell us which one you like the best down in the comments below. Leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit the share button so your friends can see it. And make sure to subscribe if you're not already. That will make you part of the PS Toy Reviews crew, where we do not allow our brains to be sucked out through those things. Have a good day. Bye, guys.